Hello my lovelies, welcome to my channel. Here we are doing the monthly reading for all zodiac signs. This is going to be for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Let's get right into your reading, Pisces. Let's see what Spirit has for you guys for this month of July 2021 in regards to the month. Let's see what you can expect for July. All right, my lovelies. Let's see what's going on here. So there is a lot of new beginnings coming for you guys, especially the third week of July all the way to August uh, is what I'm hearing. Now you do have here the temperance card. So there are certain things that you're currently going through that may be transformational in regards to healing. So for those of you guys that have been experiencing uh, difficulties in regards to health, whether it's on an emotional level, whether it's on a mental level, like anxiety, stress, uh, even depression, that's quickly going to be dissipating. What they're saying here is there is, for some of you guys, it could be that uh, for those of you that are currently medicated, um, because I am hearing like depression, um, anxiety is what's coming through very strongly. Um, even constant headaches is what I'm hearing. Um, so if you do take medication for that, I feel that this month of July, there's going to be almost like a, a need for you to, a need for for your doctor or your wherever you're getting your medications from. There's going to be some type of change here, and I feel that it's for the positive because it's going to really help you. I feel that whatever medications you may be on or you may be taking at the present time are not really helping, but I do see that there is going to be almost like a them switching some type of medication or changing the dose um, and that's definitely going to help that's definitely going to uh, set you off on the path of you know healing and being able to balance yourself now right at the center we do have the ace of wands so there are opportunities in regards to career in regards to your passions pursuits you may feel more energetic you may feel like a burst of energy um, this could be you sporadically just you know getting out of bed one day and deciding you want to rearrange your home uh wanting to revamp something this could be uh you know transformation in regards to really um anything that has to do with your home uh, rearranging certain things um when i hear transformation in regards to the dwelling it usually indicates like revamping something so it could be redoing your kitchen um changing the cabinets that type of energy um as i am seeing like a bit of construction being done so again for some of you guys this is just you uh really wanting to remove and having the need it's almost like a soul type of thing that you're experiencing right now where there is a lot of need to recharge um and move the energy around so this could be you moving or rearranging like i said furniture in your home your bedroom your living room that type of energy go with it because it is definitely going to help and you are going to allow the energies to flow more organically so uh, if you're feeling a bit uh, creative or if you're feeling the need to move things around definitely do that um, i feel that it's really going to clear out a lot of stagnant energy now right at the center here we have the queen of wands so you may be dealing with a sagittarius uh, an aries or a leo um, female in this month of july for some of you guys, this could just be an indication of you be more confident in yourself. There is some type of major transformation that's going to be happening on a physical aspect. So for some of you guys, this could be like going on a diet, changing your nutrition, changing your diet, changing um, certain aspects, even leaving certain like, uh, you know, watching what you're drinking, or this can also represent, um, this can also represent like, wanting to renew to change your image how you present yourself to the world so this could indicate changing your hair color dyeing your hair cutting your hair doing a new makeup uh, sorry not a new makeup a new makeover that type of energy as i'm sensing it purely on the physical aspect um for others of you this could be transformational this could be like going under the knife um wanting to do some type of cosmetic surgery um, that type of energy. I feel that the month of July is definitely going to be a very positive month to do that. 
um, only because I do see you extremely, your health and health wise is something that is going to be like taking center stage. So for a lot of you guys, this is taking care of your mental health. This is taking care of your emotions. This is um, doing meditation. This is taking care of yourself physically, being more proactive. Um, and I feel that this is a very positive type of energy. Why? Because we have two aces here. So again, two major beginnings that are coming and that are unfolding before you. Um, I see you guys walking away from a situation where you felt like you were a bit closed off or stagnant. Um, this could represent if you were dealing with a Taurus, this could represent you pulling away from that energy only to kind of take care of yourself. So I feel that for some of you guys, this could be like a relative. This could be someone around you. This could be a partner as well. If you felt like they were kind of trying to cage you in or being very restrictive when it came like overbearing is what I'm hearing. Um, I feel you guys pulling your energy a bit back this. And again, we do have the ace of wands here. So fire energy here as well. Leo Sagittarius Aries type of energy. Um, being more overprotective, I feel, because the more they see the transformation, the more they see uh, that you're doing a lot of self-care and that it's bringing out the best in you, I feel that the more they start to become more intimidated in the sense of losing you. So you may start to experience them being a little bit more possessive, being a little bit more jealous, that type of energy. Um, I don't see it being toxic. What I do see is, again, them being able to really vibe to the fact that, you know, you're taking care of yourself. I feel that the month of July is going to be very important for your self-care. I'm going to, I'm going to be honest and I'm going to put it out there. I feel that it's going to be crucial that whatever changes you need to make, you make them now. Um, and this could be in connection with, again, certain habits, drinking alcohol, smoking, um, you know, even doing drugs for some, uh, or taking some type of medication. It could be the reason why they were talking about medication here. It could be that, you know, you usually take two, three pills and you go down to one or two pills a day, that type of energy. Um, I feel that this is uh, very positive. Why? Because again, they're talking about nurturing yourself, taking care of yourself inside as well as out. And I feel that the more like the more confident you feel about your appearance or how you feel, how you present yourself to the world, the more you're able to take care of yourself within, the more you're able to um, value yourself or be, be able to really see your worth and understand that health is very important. So again, I feel that health um, in any aspect in your life is going to be taking center stage for the month of July uh, for the better, absolutely for the better. So I hope that this gives you guys some type of insight. I wish you guys the very best and we'll see each other soon. Bye.